Urban Gardener here, and I'm preparing my feeding for the week. So I thought I'd take you guys along, because I know some of you have never done this before, and some of you aren't making alfalfa tea yet, or might be scared to make it, or, you know, whatever. So I just wanted to show you how simple it is to make this alfalfa tea, how I do it. There's others that do different methods, but this is the, I think this is the simplest and easiest way to make alfalfa tea. What I have here is a five gallon bucket, and then I showed you on another video how I used the mesh bag to trap the alfalfa in so it's an easy cleanup. And then I can just dump that to the worms or to the compost. So that's how I do it. I got 20 cubes, 20 alfalfa cubes in there, in my mesh bag, in my five gallon bucket. So now, all I gotta do is turn on the water. There you go, I have turned on the water. Now all I gotta do is fill this five gallon bucket up. While I'm watering it in, it is mixing the juice around. I'll let this sit, today is Thursday. I will let this sit until Saturday. The benefit of this too is when you fill up your five gallon bucket and let it sit for two days, is you're letting any chlorination that may be in your city water leach out. As you can see, it's sitting in the five gallon bucket in a mesh grain bag for brewing beer. It will sit and stew out in the sun for two days. And then when I come on Saturday, I will refresh the water a little bit because it will lose some due to evaporation. I'll re and as I refill that, it actually stirs up the water and gets it all mixed up and ready to go. And then you have an awesome alfalfa feeding. And what I have done through my research is found out that an alfalfa tea, just so you can put it on the NPK scale, for those of you that really need to know an NPK, is it comes out to about 313. So that is what I have found through research is alfalfa tea is 313. Pretty easy to remember because it rhymes. So just remember, alfalfa tea is 313. Alfalfa tea is 313. So I hope that's informative. I hope that helps some of you guys that have never done the alfalfa tea. And I can tell you since I have started this season with the alfalfa tea, the results are definitely visible. So, make yourself some alfalfa tea, guys. It's awesome. Keep happy. Stay stoned. And Urban Garden!